Hello, I'm Claire Snowden, darling. Hi, I'm Laura Knowles. And we're going to talk to you about functional kinesiology and what it is and where it came from. It's so exciting. So functional kinesiology has been derived uh, basically from the fact that Laura and I have both spent uh, over a decade each in clinic and have um, come across so many gaps that traditional kinesiology leave in clinic. So what we've actually done with functional kinesiology is take the tried and tested methods and techniques that we have been using solidly um, from a variety of kinesiologies such as touch for health kinesiology, um, uh, systematic kinesiology, there's applied, applied kinesiology. kinesiology, there's loads and loads and loads of different kinesiology techniques that we've been using in clinic but we've combined that with the cutting edge research in functional nutrition. Now, the reason that this is important is because we are facing global health crises, but we're in a massive crisis with our health. And we are in a situation where the, the medical model is no longer able to support these crises. And the reason for that is because of how the medical model has to approach conditions. Um, and to a certain extent, it's also how we used to approach conditions within kinesiology. Mm. We always talk about doing root cause analysis, but actually we tend to focus on the symptom that someone is bringing in. And our experience and research shows us that that's actually not the way to work. It's, it's far too myopic. So what happened, the way that functional kinesiology actually started was I was sat on a beach in Byron Bay in 2015. Sounds nice. It was a lovely, lovely trip. Uh, And I had a very good friend who at the time was experiencing some real anxiety and depression. She had very, very bad um, menstrual cycle issues and she was also uh, putting on weight and really struggling. She was a single parent and working very hard and her stress was through the roof. And I was trying to explain to her why the way that she was comfort eating was actually causing her period issues. And I was journaling at the time and I literally just drew out a triangle. And in this triangle, I put on the legs of this triangle, I put her female hormones, I wrote stress hormones and I wrote blood sugar hormones. And then I started to explain to her how, if her blood sugars are unstable, that contributes to more stress hormones, and if her stress hormones are uh, through the roof, that will also contribute to blood sugar instability, and how all those two things then contribute to an, an issue in the female hormone cycle. And it was really just to explain to her in a very simple way what was going on in her body, and to give her an opportunity to grasp why to really focus on changing her diet and lifestyle. And from that, functional kinesiology was born. So we now call that the triangle of hormonal health. And this is actually how we explain things to clients. So fast forward a good few years, and we have done a ridiculous amount of research (laughs) and have also found how this hormonal um, storm creates so many of today's conditions. Mm. So diabetes, obesity, uh, autoimmune conditions, irritable bowel syndrome, SIBO, menopause imbalances, fertility problems, you name it, depression, anxiety, all of the stuff that people are regularly seeing doctors for and are on medication for. And we have come up with this approach for, as practitioners, how we can deal with this stuff coming into our clinic, not just from a symptom perspective. Because I know from my perspective that often I'd have clients coming in with something like four different autoimmune conditions. And obviously we don't work on the conditions in alternative health. We work with the body, which then allows the body to support itself to get better. (coughs) But... We, it was a bit like a minefield and I didn't know if I was doing more harm than good and I didn't know if what I was really doing was doing anything and I, I sometimes just didn't know where to work and when someone presented me with quite a clean diet I'd go well it's not their diet looking at it this way has completely changed mm. how we work in clinic and the results are really really fast I think the other important thing is that Claire and I have both been Uh, alternative health teachers for a long time and so we have seen we've had our own experiences of being um, uh, alternative health students Mm. and then becoming practitioners and we've also seen many many students come through Mm. our college and other colleges and we really saw that 
there can be an overwhelming amount of information out there and particularly with kinesiology which is an amazing therapy there are so many techniques but it can be too much and yes. so we were seeing students come out with the uh, okay so I've got 2,000 techniques and I've now got someone in my clinic what do, what I, do? do, what do I do and so <clears throat> what we wanted to really do with functional kinesiology is simplify it mm. take the information create protocols so that when someone comes in and they're exhibiting certain kinds of symptoms then you've got a really clear direction of, of yes. where to go and what to do and you feel confident yes. we wanted to create really confident practitioners yes. who were really really able to help yes. people Yes, so the protocols are um, basically uh, in each module that we uh, we have on the course, which we're going to be talking you through in individual video videos. There is a protocol for each module, and it's it's we've bro we've done the hard work for you. So when someone comes in, we're presenting with this. Let's look at this technique first, and if that's not the one that needs doing, then we look at this. Then we look at this, and so we've done that hard work for you, so that you can just get into clinic and start practicing. Mm. And then as you become really confident competent kinesiologists we love saying that phrase <laughs> then you can start to get really creative and do what we do which is to tie all the strands together this is in no way limiting you to be expressive and creative as a therapist it's really just so that you can get in and know exactly what to do right from the word go and what I also really love about the course is that we have done a lot of the background information mm. or the lectures that you usually get in your training we've put them on videos yes. so then when you come on the on the workshops you've done the background knowledge and then it's about applying it because that's the important yes. bit when you're in clinic having that okay I know what to do here. Yeah. It's not just this information overload. You can spend your time at home going through all of the information, digesting that, going through it again and, and again. Seeing and seeing the again. demos over and over and over again, not just once in clinic. You get those demos as, as you know, you have lifetime access to these videos. So it's there. So yeah, that's really important to say. So the way that the training is broken down is you have um, all your online resources. So that's all of the techniques and all of the underpinning knowledge online for you to watch over and over again and they come with online resources that you can download so that's just going to be all your information then once a month <clears throat> about that for over the course of the eight modules you attend a workshop and in that workshop attendance we will be refining your techniques and we are going to be really honing you in to become very competent practitioners there are also, there's home study so that you can start to really get your head clicked into where we're coming from. So there's um, lovely homework books and mm. there's case studies that you're going to be doing. Um, and then there's obviously the assessment process at the end. So this is a fully accredited course. Uh, it's accredited through the Kinesiology Federation. It is fully insurable um, mm. and it is in line with the National Occupational Standards, which is really, really exciting. Mm. And it's also really good fun. Oh, it's really good fun. <laughs> I think this is, like, we have been doing this 15 years, 20 years, 4,000 4, years. 4,000 years. And still, it makes me goosebumpy. And teaching this information and learning this information and putting this information together still is one of the most exciting things. Mm, absolutely. And so being able to tap into that passion of teachers who are on the on the um, front line with this because we have our own clinics and we are seeing these um, clients and, and we're going through this ourselves with our own health journey that yeah. you know we got into this because we were unwell and we are still dealing with this stuff on a daily basis learning how to manage both of our conditions which aren't you know curable conditions they are treatable they are manageable but they are they are that's what we have to do it's an ongoing process mm -hmm. and so through that we have learned more and more and more and have put all of that research into functional kinesiology and it is proper research it's like all of this stuff is really cutting edge research it's all the stuff that's out there that people just aren't stringing together yeah so we've i looked at the clinical trials yeah. we've brought that information into this course yeah so i really believe that this is the only way we're going to really be able to effectively deal with the health conditions that are, are affecting society today. We needed a modern approach to deal with these modern conditions. And that's what we are offering. We're so modern. Yeah, <laughs> yeah modern. Yeah, modern. <laughs> 
Um, so for more information, go through the website, see what you see, get in touch, ask us the questions. And uh, for all the different modules, they are listed below with videos explaining uh, more about each module. And we really look forward to you being on the course. Yeah.